Are you ready to be inspired? It's your time to get made. I'm your host, Yash Samlani. The co-founder of MADE, Yash Samlani is an award-winning kid entrepreneur. He has won the 2014 Ernst & Young Youth Entrepreneur Award and has been featured on various national media and spoken at international business conferences. This episode, I'm interviewing the 11-year-old musical wonder, DJ Falon. My best friend, Daniel Aresius, is joining in the fun. What motivation led you to start your venture? Well... How I started off was that my mom had a friend and he was going to open a DJ school. And so he said, oh, your son should pop by sometime. So I did really well in the classes. And I got a scholarship. And then while I was seven, um, I DJed a party at my friend's birthday. And then he gave me 20 bucks for it. And I, I kind of just went on from that. Hey guys, it, uh, my name is DJ Fulano from New York City. And I'm going to be teaching Yash, his friend here, um, a little bit about DJing. We're got, we have our turntables, you know, our vinyls. And now, here's how we're going to start off. Um, put your hand on 9 o'clock and I'm going to teach you how to baby scratch. How long have you been a DJ? I'm about to be 12, so approximately 7 years. That is a long time. Yeah. What part of being a DJ do you love best? My motivation has always been, I want to play my music to make people happy. And you know, in the crowd, people will be dancing and having fun, you know, that's, that's my main goal. And it doesn't matter if I make money for that or not, as long as I make the people happy, I'm, I'm proud of that. You're gonna start right here. Now go one, two, three, four, right? So here we go. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. All right, good job. So it sounded great. And now what you're gonna do is um, when you scratch like that, after you find the right part in the song and you drop, you have to drop it on the one. Were there any people or organizations who helped you to start your business? You know, there, there were multiple people, my mom, and my dad for playing music for me while I was younger and my mentor. Well, one of the main people is my mom. And, um, you know, she'd pay for all my lessons and she'd uh, push me to practice more. What advice do you have for other parents who have kids who want to start a business? I think my advice is to really listen, right? I think a big piece of figuring out who you are to become is listening to the whispers, right? There's an inner voice inside of you that tells you, go, 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 right? Yeah. Don't you feel that? Yeah. You hear that, right? Mm -hmm. And you're listening to your inner voice. I think parents have to listen when their kids communicate with them about things that they love. What makes you excited about working with your son in a business? Watching him do something that he loves. I think much like you, when you're doing something that you feel passionate about and excited, yeah. right? Um, I love to see young people living in that space of, um, of their power, their personal power, really finding something to connect to at an early age. And now what we're gonna do is I wanna teach you how to use a crossfader because that's how you have this song on this vinyl go to this on this vinyl that you're using, right? So yep, keep doing that. Well, I'm on tons of different kinds of social media. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and I also have a website, um, which is fulanosworld.com. You know, on social media, I'll say to my followers, oh, um, you know, I'm DJing this this weekend, come check me out, here's the address, blah, 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 here's tickets, this is free, blah, blah, blah. And you know, I, I more um, market off of that. How are you trying to increase your bookings? You know, when I DJ for different companies, 
you know, they'd shout me out and I DJ for Good Morning America and they shout me out on Instagram. And I got more popular from that. We are so proud of DJ Fulano, Fulano's World, what's up? Uh, he's been studying here since he's been five years old and we've seen him make incredible progress. So I definitely appreciate his willingness and his hard work and his determination. We're very happy to be a part of his success story. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let go. Hi, five. That was great. All right. Why did you choose to incorporate social outreach in your venture? I definitely love helping people and, you know, making them happy. And I've DJ for VH1 Save the Music to get instruments and music into schools. And also, I've DJ for Saving Kids Cancer, uh, which is a cancer organization. How are you handling customer service? Before I do the gigs, I meet up with the people and they'll say, okay, um, we really like this kind of music. Or the kids are gonna like this kind of music. Or this crowd is gonna say, I wanna hear this song. And so, I have to put all of that stuff into a list, mixing up all the kinds of music that they want. So the main thing is like meeting up with them before I, I do anything, you know? How do you hope to grow your vision? Well, um, I hope to DJ for bigger places and become, you know, more popular and more well-known. And I, I hope to become very big one day, you know? And, you know, maybe become the official DJ at the Knicks or some basketball team or something like that. So I'm just pushing to become the best and biggest I can be. It was awesome or was it was yeah. it awesome or was it amazing awesome and amazing boom perfect thanks for watching i hope this episode inspired you to get interactive get empowered and get your business made Join us each month as we feature more amazing kid entrepreneurs. If you know of any kid or youth entrepreneurs whose businesses should be featured on Get Made, please contact me.